This is problem 4.55. They have asked us to find out the not equivalent circuit at terminal A and B. First we will find out RN. To do that, we know we have to short the voltage source and uh, current source will be made open. In this question, we have a 2 volt voltage source in this point, so we have shorted out. And now we have two ways. Uh, one is adding one ampere current source at this terminal or one ampere, or one volt voltage source at this terminal. I have added one volt voltage source at terminal A and B. Uh, we can say uh, the I is equal this voltage is divided by this resistance. This was uh, given in the question. So this is the value of I as I have picked. Uh, v not to v 1 volt so i can say vav is equal 1 volt 2 now we apply kcl to this point i not current is going in this current is also going in and ati is going out this current will be vav divided by 50k we have rearranged the equation 1 and now we'll be putting the value of i and vav here we'll get i naught equal 1 into 10 to the power minus 5 ampere now we know the voltage across this line is 1 volt and the current which is i naught is 1 into 10 to the power minus 5 ampere so rn will be 1 into 10 to the power 5 ohms or 100 kilo ohms now we'll find out i n this circuit is actually the given circuit in the question. We have just shorted this line and this is I n. So we can see this line is shorted and at this point the voltage is zero. So at this point the voltage is zero. So this line is shorted and we don't need to count this 50 kilo ohm resistance. So you can say I n is minus 80 I as the directions are opposite. And VAV is 0 volt as this line is shorted and we don't need to count this 50 kilo ohm resistance. So this will be 0 2 as VAV is equal 0. Now this I will be 2 volt divided by 80 kilo ohm which is 0 0.25 milliampere. Putting the value of I here we will get IN is minus 20 milliampere. Thanks for watching the video.